In this video we want to look at the uh, two-dimensional assembly drawing. Of course you're going to bring the uh, the picture in, if you will, from your presentation file. And then we just want to uh, attach balloons to all those different components. And uh, you can attach them to just one side or the other. You don't have to attach them to both sides. I picked this side. It seemed like the the logical spot for me. So you don't have to uh, duplicate all that on the back or on this side over here. It's that's not going to be necessary. Uh, it does have the quantity in the parts list, so uh, I think that can be figured out when the people are looking at the parts live. But there are all the different components, and they, you know you might want to make sure they're all lined up. And then of course you're going to want to attach a parts list and make that parts list go from the bottom up and adjust the columns if you can to uh, make sure everything runs one line. It shows all the different hardware types so on. And then these are the different part numbers and I'll show you how to set up those part numbers and the descriptions uh, in another short video that I will make um, in post so that you can do that. But basically we have to go back to the individual components and uh, put those values in. It, it's a pretty easy process. It's in the uh, I properties. So we'll look at that here in just a little bit. Uh, you don't have to change any of the columns or anything. Just change the sizes and, and adjust that uh, so that they'll, they'll look decent. Also make sure you go to the uh, field text and insert your name here and then put all this information in and we'll all be happy. This uh, assembly drawing should not be too difficult for you to uh, to manage so uh, that's what we'll do on that. Like I said I'll create a, a video to show you how to get these these part numbers and uh, the descriptions in each one of the parts that you're going to attach to the assembly.